Good morning, Colorado. Welcome to a Monday edition of Local Biz Buzz. I'm your host, Larry Herz. If you're having a case of the Mondays, I have your cure today. I have Darby Sweets and Dog Treats in the studio. Here's Darby herself. Welcome. Hello. Thank you so much for having me. So, typical story. Saw her stuff on Instagram, DM'd her. And I'm like, I want to try these. And here she is. And then it turns out we have a couple of mutual friends, Becca from Sugar Sisters and Sweet Sara, who's to me like the most talented pastry chef in town yes. from uh, Kevin Taylor Restaurant Group. Uh, give us a little history of you and, and how you got into this business. Alrighty, so I started my business in 2016 when I graduated college and I uh, love baking from a young age. I graduated from MSU Denver, but I'm actually a self-taught baker. Uh, over the years, I've worked in the industry and decided I want to start my own business, specializing in sweet treats for humans and canines. Here I have some pup cakes, because dogs like cake too. We can't forget about our four-legged friends. They're all natural and organic. Then today I brought a, a range of different cupcakes. My business, I have three different sizes, full size, medium, and minis. Ooh, I hadn't seen anybody do that before, three different sizes. I love that idea. People love it because some people want just bite size, some people really want to indulge in a full cupcake. I would say the medium are the best sellers because you feel full after three, four bites and then maybe go back for another one. Okay, what flavors do you got over there? So I brought Butterscotch Heaven, Banana Love, Caramelicious, Strawberry Dream, this is Peanut Butter Divine, and then I have a few I brought for Larry, I brought some Gluten Free, Vegan, and Classic American. All right, so what flavors are these? That is the Peanut Butter Divine, and then that is a Chocolate uh, Delight. Okay, and then, so for the ones for dogs, could I eat that? Yeah, you could eat that. It, okay. um, it's pretty bland. I tried it. I, <laughs> I might what's, what's in it? So it's just uh, some eggs, baking powder, baking soda. Then we got cream cheese, uh, organic dairy, uh, Greek yogurt, and then peanut butter, and then uh, the milk bone on top. I actually have my own dog myself. Uh, he's a little mini poodle. His name is Rolo. Cute. And he loves cupcakes. Anytime I say cupcake, he runs right <laughs> over and he tilts his head. Last night he got to try some. He, for a little dog, I still give him a big cupcake, but I make two different sizes for your small dog or your big dog, any shape or size. And they're perfect for dog parties, dog birthdays. Everyone just enjoys celebrating when the adoption of when they got their dog. So I do all different types of little dog parties. What, um, is this a big part of your business or? So at the beginning it was a big part of my business. I was selling to different types of come sit stay, like where they keep your huh? dogs and groomings yeah. and uh, Bentleys. I sell them at Bentleys in their little carrying. But then I realized a lot of the money uh, was in human consumption <laughs> and weddings and birthday parties and corporate events and catering. So I just kind of do dogs on the, ch on the side. And my main focus is definitely humans. Um, but Denver is such a great place. There's dogs everywhere. <laughs> breweries, I can go to breweries and sell pup cakes. Um, and then... So that, that brings me to the question of how can people get your treats? How do they get them? So I have a few uh, platforms. I have my website, darbysweets.com. You can just fill out the information page. I have my Darby Sweets uh, Facebook page. And I have Instagram. You can direct, direct message me. And I also have my email, dar, uh, darbysweets at gmail.com. And I'll respond within 24 hours. And we can create your pup cake or cake of your dreams. Phone calls? Phone calls, yeah, you can call me too. Give them the number. 720-626-5681. And what kind of lead time do you need? I need 48 hour notice um, because I do work a full-time job as a cannabis baker. I make all the edibles for all the stoners out there in Colorado. <laughs> None of this is infused because, you know, uh, it is Monday. <laughs> <laughs> doesn't, doesn't, in this office, we don't care. Okay. <laughs> We'd be ready to go on Monday. We'll, we like our edibles here. Yep, so once you place an order or call me, I will respond within 24 hours and get back to you, and we can work together and create uh, the cake of your dreams. Now, you wanted me to try and 
Then so say, I want you to try this one. This one right here. Yes. Okay. This one. Yes. <laughs> and I have to tell you whether it's what you think of it, and um, whether I think it's vegan, vegan, classic American, or gluten free. Vegan, classic American, gluten free. <laughs> I would guess classic American. Okay. All right. And now She's try this tell me. banana. I'll have you try Here? some of them. Yes. All right. Should I just take the little guy? Sure. Well, no, this one. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> so this is banana. Yes. Banana with cream cheese frosting and crushed hazelnuts. It's a little different than that. A little bit. Okay. Because there's banana in it, isn't there? Yes. So that's what you're using to keep it moist, I think. I think that's like your substitute for dairy. So I'm going to say like this might be your gluten-free or your vegetarian. Well, wait, you have to try one more. Okay. And then we'll go from there. <laughs> You're going to try this one, the Caramelicious. So it's just Ooh, a that's, vanilla. That's heavier. That one's, okay, so it's a vanilla cupcake filled with caramel and then a caramel mm. buttercream and a caramel drizzle. And it is Caramelicious. <laughs> that's freaking delicious. Thank you. Okay, and then I want you to try one more. The really? Butterscotch Kevin. And then... Who's I'll got the best job? <laughs> this one. I haven't I tried this you, one? Uh, no, that is Butterscotch Heaven. Oh, okay. So it's a vanilla cupcake filled with butterscotch ganache, a butterscotch buttercream, and a drizzle of butterscotch. Well, this is my first time having any of your pastries. And none of these taste gluten-free or vegan to me at all. They're all rich and moist. None of them are dense or heavy, which is what I get from gluten-free a lot. Yeah, I'm clueless. I got okay. nothing for you. So the banana, <laughs> this banana one, that was my gluten-free. I thought you'd use banana to, to make it moist, so that's why I thought that had and something. And then these ones that you tried, those are the classic American, so those have butter and dairy and milk. So then you're going to tell me... That is my vegan cupcake. <laughs> yeah, you would never believe that that's vegan. Exactly. I, it's... It is um, a work of art, definitely. Okay. Give them the website again so they can order your uh, cupcakes. So just visit cakes. me at darbysweets.com, and there I have a contact page, and you can fill out all the information, and I will contact you soon. Thank you for coming in. Pleasure to meet you. Thank you so much. So, so good. Like, I really couldn't tell the difference in any of them. They were all, like, bomb. Uh, we'll see you today at 1130. We have Colorado Campfire coming on. What's for lunch? Let's eat.